An entire community comes together to help a nine year old boy get a service dog. Two News reporter Jamil Donath shows us how the family is hoping to return the favor. Okay, check down. A dog trainer at nine years old. He is the, my best friend. To Matthew Baines, Levi isn't just a pal, she's his protector. Levi, look here. The third grader has a high functioning form of autism and a genetic disorder that makes him very weak and unable to sweat, which means he gets tired from doing simple tasks. Anything like that little boys like to do, he cannot physically do. Like he cannot open his locker. His mother Angie decided the best solution for her son to get him a service dog. But service dogs are pricey pets. Levi was the cheapest service dog Angie could find and she cost $8,000. But after reaching out to her friends and family on social media, the entire community pitched in to help, including his classmates. We have been really blessed by the city of Claremore. So when Matthew gets overheated, they're going to take a shirt that he's wearing and have Levi smell it basically by saying Levi find it and then she will smell it and be able to pick up on that scent every time that Matthew is overworking himself. She's going to alert him before his temperature gets too high. Gladwag service dogs in Tulsa is helping Matthew get acquainted with his new buddy and bodyguard. Good. And now halfway to reaching their goal of $10,000 the Baines want to give back. Matthew kind of tell me goes mommy I just want to help another person get their best friend. So we're like, okay, so how can you say no to that? <laughs> Paying it forward, one dog lover to another. She just loves me. Jamil Donath, 2 News Works for You. Now, Angie says every penny they make after their goal will go to help other children in need of a service dog. If you want to donate, you can go to GoFundMe.com slash Matt's Buddy.